everybody. We're here at the uh, Favor Dykes uh, State Park in uh, St. Augustine. It's not the preferred park to be in. Because that's um, Anastasia, which is a gorgeous park. So um, this is one is 30 miles south of St. Augustine. So let me take you over to the campsite. I actually had to come over here and make sure I got the name right. I think it's called Favor. I mean, pronounced Favor Dykes State Park. Another one of my senseless videos for your entertainment and laughing pleasure. Hopefully you all get a big kick out of my insanity. All right, so let's take a little walk over to the uh, our campsite. Which we got a choice campsite. Um, I'm gonna spin around here and turn around and give you guys a little thing here. But that's actually the restroom and the showers. And look, I walked down this little path here. And look, look at that. Well, what do you think? There's the van, man. <clears throat> Here's the van, we brought the bikes. We set up in about 10 minutes, probably even sooner than that. We got lucky. We got a concrete uh, pad. Take you around here. Okay, we're all plugged in. Maybe family walking around and stuff. Tristan's picking up internet and he's inside the van on the computer. Go figure. There's your bike racks. Got some neighbors over there with a little fire going. So, this is it. We're getting this thing going here. One of the last dry camping runs around. Um, before we head out, let me give you a little glimpse of the van set up here. <laughs> the uh, boat ramp in the little park area here as you can see people come out here on canoes and stuff it's pretty cool you know um, you can actually take this I think you call it a canal or a river all the way up uh, in between a1a in between st. Augustine Beach and uh, end up in uh, over there by the fort there's some folks here with the cool looking thing uh, airboat over there on the other side if you can get a shot of that there's, a, there's like a little park area over there you can hang out they got like uh, you know you can do a picnic and all that crap Oh man, that's freaking crazy. That is a crazy ride on that bike. I mean, I'm getting dizzy. I have to keep looking at it over and over and I'm getting dizzy, but hang in there. It's almost over. This is the psychedelic part of the movie. You know what I'm saying, man? It's, you know, just enjoy it. It's a little trippy. Cheers.
All right, that was fun. That was a great ride Tristan and I took through the park. Um, went through uh, the nature trail, out to the boat ramp, and a service road that Tristan found. Later on that day, we decided to head over to uh, St. Augustine, uh, the old city. Um, actually, to the St. Augustine Amphitheater, because our neighbors told us about a food festival that was going on there. So I got a little bit of footage on my way there, and after the, the uh, food festival, we left. We weren't there that long. It really wasn't all that. Um, but we said, let's go over to the old city and go maybe grab some lunch over there. Um, however, apparently everybody else decided to do the same thing because the traffic uh, was ridiculous. It was about 20 minutes of traffic. So, you know, we decided um, let's head back to the camp. So we did. So let's look at that footage. Cheers. All right, we're here at the St. Augustine uh, Amphitheater. They're having a party, so we're gonna go check it out. Hey, so I found this really cool barbecue joint, man, called Smoky D's. Good stuff, we're gonna grab some of this and go back to the campsite and uh, eat it, check it out. Drove through uh, St. Augustine, Went to the uh, amphitheater. It was all right. Eh. This old city was too crowded to get into, so we're just gonna head back. But now, this is what we got for dinner, man. I can't wait. This looks like a really good joint. All right. All right, man. I'm here to say uh, bye to my neighbors that we were hanging out last night. You guys have a safe trip. And uh, I'm gonna go for a little ride on the bike and see what's up. Check out the park and try to make this entertaining for you people, all right? And if you don't like it, just tell me I'm a bum and say something bad, I don't know, funny though. All right, 10-4. <laughs> <laughs> all right, and hey, I wanna see you guys from Alabama, uh, you know, jump on my YouTube here and uh, say something, you know, or comment or something piffy, you know? All right. All right. We'll find you once we get some good internet connection. That's service. it. Yeah, man. Just remember, the epic road trip. You got to just look for the epic road trip. It should right. be there. We will. All right, everybody. Welcome back to the uh, epic road trip. Uh, cool little park. We did a little shakedown run over here to uh, St. Augustine. Uh, couldn't get uh, to stay at the really nice park, which stinks because then I could have ridden the bikes over to the old section but um anyways this place is really nice um decent f facilities really no complaint here in the facilities a little old but uh we got really lucky we got this choice uh spot here as you can see it's got a concrete pad and uh you got that little walkway right to the restroom over there um which is amazing really simple um, a lot of nature Really cool, man. Anywho, uh, so far so good. Everything's working good on the uh, on the epic road trip machine van. Um, uh, no problems, man. It's really working good. AC is working decent. It's going cold. It's really loud. That air conditioner, I gotta admit, is uh, really, 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 really loud. Uh, so it makes it a little bit more. Um, I don't know, hard to get used to when to sleep and stuff. I ended up turning it off in the middle of the night and just let it was cool enough in here, believe it or not, that it wasn't that bad. I, I actually uh, slept okay and, and even Tristan was saying that he was a little cold as well, so worked out well. Um, oh, uh, right across from there, uh, we were hanging out with those kids down there, young group of kids, uh, good folks from uh, Alabama. Um, and we probably shouldn't have said we were talking politics, but anyways, uh, we had a good time, a uh, good conversation, met some folks uh, as well on the campsite next door, they got a great dog, uh, met them, uh, it was a really good time, and uh, I think it's great for Tristan, which is exactly what I want, you know, meet different people, different perspectives, and things like that, so... 
That was cool. Uh, this is boring. I'm boring myself right now. What? So if I'm boring myself, it's got to be boring for you. All right. Well, let me try it again. That was only two minutes, so that ain't bad. Hey, I'm getting better at this, I think. I hope. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching, and please give me some suggestions and things that I should talk about so that I don't bore myself to death like I am right now. Uh, just mumbling, you know, bullshit. Uh, all right. Rock and roll. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and please comment. Oh, a big shout out to um, Emmy Eaton Becker uh, for figuring out uh, the thing on the, um, as far as YouTube is concerned. Apparently, uh, you need to set up, uh, I guess, what, make a profile and they call it a channel. So, uh, in order for you to comment, you have to do this on a computer first before you can use the uh, smartphone app. Once uh, that's done, then, uh, as I understand it, then you can use the, uh, the app uh, to uh, perhaps comment. I don't know if anybody really knows. Well, actually, Emmy did. She figured Whoa. it out already. So, uh, big uh, thumbs up and uh, thank you very much, Emmy, for figuring that out for us. And uh, I think that's all for now.